For over three decades, this man has made music and entertained folks from Philadelphia to Portland, Maine, with stops along the way in places as exotic as Buffalo, New York and Milksham, England. His music has been variously described as power pop, alt Americana, neo-psychedelic, post-punk, indie pop alt-psychedelic, heartfelt and surprisingly delicious. As a solo artist, or with bands such as the middle class individuals, The Apathy Lads, Babalu, Sky Grits, Sir Dot, King Memphis, The Frode Escaper, The Lomax, and Pete Witham and the Cosmic Zombies, this man, Dave Ragsdale, has written and recorded hundreds of songs and appeared on dozens of albums. So why have so few people heard of him? And why, for the past decade, has the music world heard so little from him? Those are questions that this film sets out to answer. And the answers might surprise you as much as they surprised us. You can't prove nothing but you know you're in pain After nearly a decade of inexplicable silence, Ragsdale is finally beginning to write and record a new album's worth of material. But why has it taken him so long to make the effort? Quite a few of his former colleagues had lots to say on that subject. It's quite stubborn. But the theory we found most intriguing, and least likely to incur libel charges, was hinted at by this fellow musician. Dave's writing again? Music. Finally, I've been, I have been begging him for years, must be seven or eight years since he's written a song, at least one that he's played me. I keep telling him, Dave, you got to get back to writing, man. All he does is, he's, just for years, he's been obsessed with this band, Autumn Carousel. <laughs> Just what you said to me But it sounded quite good It had a very pleasing ring in my ear And if you don't mind, would you please Tell 
Many of Ragsdale's peers are less inclined to focus on his long and crippling obsession with Autumn Carousel, and are instead asking the question, how has he been able to write again? The answer to this question also depends on who you ask, and we found plenty of folks who were willing to go on record with their opinions. So, uh, Dave is a... But most of them were incredibly boring. The one exception was singer-songwriter Josh Rolson. Yeah, I've, uh, I've known Dave for a while, and we've been, uh, you know, we've been... Working on some music together recently, uh, which has been, it's okay, you know, it's, uh, it's adequate to get the job done. But uh, it's nice to see these back into it, getting back into the music thing, finally gonna do some releases and whatnot. Satellite over the city, making a path down the freeway, makes you sad and you don't know. In fact, I consider myself more of an artist than a human being. And the days go by without a word. A big blue sky without a bird. Doesn't mean you can't get hurt when the satellites fly and the trains go by and the day. The timing's a little weird, but you know. What do you mean by that? Well, I don't know. It's I feel awkward even mentioning it. It's just kind of it's one of those things that kind of in the background it nags at you for a while. You know, it just keeps coming back to you. It just uh, I don't know. Maybe it's nothing, but uh, you know. Well, maybe you maybe you're aware of this. I don't know, but Dave's got a, a daughter, and uh, she recently started playing music. Uh, ukulele, I think, and, and drums, and uh, I don't know. I've heard some of the stuff she's making up and playing, and I mean, maybe you should hear it, make, make a judgment call, I don't know, but uh, I mean, either way, it's good. I'm glad Dave's getting back into it, even if it's not really his, well, you know, I mean, whatever, it's, it's great. I'm really happy for him. That's okay because you Regardless of how or why, the fact is that David Ragsdale has finally decided to emerge from his self-imposed artistic exile and give the world yet another taste of his unique brand of alt-country psychedelic power pop music. And it really is, as they say, surprisingly delicious. Yeah, all right. Recording now? Yeah. Guitar bands are on the way out. No, you wouldn't miss them. You want to say no? I did. I did. I did. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Oh, yes, I did. Oh.